Hey everybody, my name is Ivica, thank you so much for joining me on my latest Fortnite creative beginner tutorial video that will show you how you can create realistic snow for your Fortnite island and for your level. To do that we're going to use several elements and I'm going to show them both to you. First we're going to use what is, let me just search here, a VFX spawner. You have it here, as you can see it spawns different visual effects. And the second element we're going to use is the Sky Dome. Now I have an older level, so in your case, if you're making this after I publish the video on a new level, Sky Dome is going to be likely day and night cycle, a different device, different sounding device, but one that uses all of the options from Sky Dome and adds a few more. So you can use that as well. It's just as effective as the Sky Dome, but I'm going to use the Sky Dome and I'm going to use the VFX spawner. So first, let's create that snow. We have the spawner here, we're going to place it, we're going to edit it under all options and instead of disco balls, we're going to go with snow and we're going to add the spawn rate, as you can see that determines the tempo of the VFX spawns to maximum, which is two. Once we do that, the snowflakes start dropping down as you can see and we have our snow the second thing of course we want to do is to change the dynamic of the sky itself so to do that we're going to set the sky dome and it's here so we're going to place it and edit it under all options enable during all phases yes we're going to set light source place to none because when we have kind of a very snowy day we feel like there's little or no light we're going to go and change the sky dome colors to dark gray all of them will be dark gray so that snow is better visible and this can be a lighter tone of gray we're going to keep stars invisible. We're going to keep fog density relatively low because we want, don't want too much fog, which will make the VFX spawner of snow too obscure. Fog color is also going to be gray. And here under the ambient light, we can also go with a grayish option. We're going to pull off the ambient lights and we're going to use clouds. And we can go either with twisty or realistic, but we'll keep it to realistic and making them move a bit faster. And for cloud color, again, we're going to go with gray. And with that, we have kind of a somber grayish sky. The clouds are not visible still yet, but there should be later on. And we have our snowfall. Now let's check it out in the game itself. Here we are. The snow is starting to appear. We can now of course edit different options and change different elements to this setup. We can make the sky not so dark gray. We can add further tones. The clouds are not visible presently but they will be loaded at some point. And of course we can kind of change adapt the way we see snow and we maybe add further spawners some that have a lower spawn rate and all with this effect of kind of early snow in a let's say late winter day starting to fall there you have it a pretty simple setup hopefully you found this video interesting hopefully you found it useful if you did please consider supporting me through a range of means which include my patreon page which include becoming a member of my channel Checking out my books on Amazon, all of those links are in the description below. But of course, the cheapest, easiest and fastest way to support me is to subscribe to my channel and be here for my new content. That's all for me. Thank you so much for being here. Thanks so much for watching. My name is Ivica. Have a great day and have loads of fun in your Fortnite Creative Islands. Until my next video. Bye bye.